Cooking for many Ghanaians isn't a chore but a cultural pride, a way of life that ingrained in one's upbringing. Perhaps the reason there is a lot of love among many for the kitchen. Clean energy advocate Faustina Boache believes the source of fuel used for cooking matters because women stand at grave health risk which are often ignored. For many homes in Ghana, the readily available source of energy is charcoal. It accounts for a sizable portion of the primary energy for households and small-scale businesses. It is a lifesaver for the predominantly working class who prefer cooking gas, kerosene or electric stoves when these options fail. However, it is a silent killer. Or being done so Henry, he is unhappy with the impact of the dependence of his constituents on charcoal and firewood as sources of energy. Um, energy for cooking in this area is basically um, the firewood, charcoal and gas. It has caused de deforestation in, 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 in most of um, um, the forest areas over here because basically the people depend on firewood and to get firewood you have to for, for um, trees and also to get um, charcoal you also have to for trees and use it to burn um, the charcoal. Perhaps the popular meals from local kitchens make many oblivious of these life-threatening risks associated with the easily accessible energy sources. A recent study by the Ghana Energy Commission shows over 20,000 premature deaths in 2016 were caused by household air pollution. These victims used smoke-emitting stoves paired with fuel like charcoal and firewood. Globally, the numbers are high. The World Health Organization pegs persons dying from pollution caused by smoke from cooking fires at 3.8 million each year. The way out, according to energy experts, is the use of clean energy. Liquefied petroleum gas provides a safer option, but experts say there are cleaner alternatives. It is the use of ethanol-based stoves. Ethanol is extracted from cassava, sugar, guinea corn or millet. Global interest in the use of ethanol has peaked because of the depletion of energy sources and deliberate attempts to protect the environment. Ethanol is not poisonous and does not cause any environmental hazard. One Ghanaian entrepreneur leading this charge to change cooking behavior is Luvans Owusu Techi the director of the Institute of Sustainable Energy and Environmental Solutions and CEO for the Sustainable Energy Technology Limited. He is into the distribution of ethanol-based cooking stoves. He believes these stoves will help protect the environment and provide efficient means of cooking.
Michael Amoa is a creative director of Econexis. Econexis is a company that supplies the ethanol gel. I caught up with him demonstrating how this clean energy source could be used in cooking stoves. He said ethanol reduces the health challenge associated with cooking. Some residents in the Krapem North and Ningo Pram Pram districts who have been using the ethanol based cooking stoves have been given an account of the experience. It's user friendly and, and I mean it's mobility, okay. As we are seated here, this is a porch, okay. I can decide to uh, use it inside in the kitchen or even outside as we are here anyway. So that's, that's it. And it's also fast okay, in its usage. And in, in terms of security with children, as you saw in the beginning, it was my, my son who lighted it. The Africa Center for Energy Policy has keen interest in clean energy. It's been pioneering the adoption of ethanol-based cooking stoves in the Kyapim North and Ningu Pram Pram districts. Policy lead for climate change and energy transition at ASEP, Charles Jim Ofori, says their interest is sparked by the global call for climate action. According to him, adoption of alternative cleaner energy sources will mitigate the impact of climate change on the region. He indicated that the country, being a signatory to helping reduce CO2 emissions globally, must champion a conscious shift in technologies used in cooking. Clean cooking is very integral to the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. And it's very important, especially in relation to its potential to reduce um, the environmental degradation through the felling down of trees, and also health-wise to reduce the incidence of household air pollution that has its attendant impact on health, especially on women and children who are very vulnerable. Ghana has undertaken several initiatives to ensure investors access to clean cooking and have introduced several technologies. But we still have a long way to go and there is still more room for improvement if we want to achieve this aim we must accelerate our efforts through the provision of other alternatives towards um, clean cooking. 
SM believes that using ethanol as another alternative provides us with the ability to accelerate our aim towards universal access to um, clean technologies. So for we indicated that the promotion of such clean technology has a potential of creating an avenue for youth employment. Our pilot study on the use of ethanol as a clean cooking alternative show a lot of favorable attitude and positive attitude towards the use of ethanol as a clean cooking alternative. And we believe that if we are able to improve on the accessibility of the stoves and then the fuels, it could be very competitive on the market. It's important that we embrace this new technology. We could have benefits not just in terms of clean cooking but also ripple impacts on the other sectors of the economy, particularly how we'll be able to bring farmers into the production value chain when it comes to ethanol. That could help to provide alternate livelihoods and also support industrialization and provide jobs for the people. That's not the only benefit of cleaner energy alternatives. Madame Faustina Boache says women can be economically empowered using cleaner energy sources. Clearly, the traditional energy sources such as charcoal and firewood are the readily accessible options for many domestic households, but their damage to the continent and the people who use them cannot be underestimated. Perhaps cleaner energy alternatives are the way to go when preparing your favorite dish. Mm -hmm.